Dog refuses to give birth. Vet sees ultrasound and instantly pulls out phone. She couldn't believe what she was showing her as she counted. She forgot to breathe momentarily, covering her widening eyes with her hands. How could this be possible? But there was no time to wonder. She needed to make a decision right now. Chris and Marisa, proud dog parents to 10 pit bulls, had been rescuing the breed for years, but they'd never witnessed anything like what they saw that day. Life was never boring with so many dogs, but the couple decided to visit the local animal shelter to see if they could do more for the misunderstood breed. The couple shared their love for animals, and Marisa's relationships had failed in the past due to her overwhelming passion for dogs. Her boyfriends could never understand why she wanted to rescue so many until she met Chris. The couple's love grew every day as they shared their love for rescued animals. When Marisa and Chris arrived at the shelter, they noticed immediately that most of the dogs there were pit bulls. Unfortunately, most shelters and rescue centers house an enormous amount of dogs and cats, and the couple felt an overwhelming need to save them all. They were greeted by so many wagging tails at Pibbles and More Animal Rescue, or PMAR, that they knew that they had to make a tough decision. However, the couple was unaware that their lives were about to change forever. It's common knowledge that the pit bull breed of dog, due to their fearsome appearance, is often very misunderstood. In some states, it's even illegal to own one. But that never stopped Marisa and Chris. The couple could never understand why the breed had such a bad reputation and had owned pit bulls for all their lives. They were determined to help this breed in any way they could. Still, they never realized the predicament that awaited them. The pit bull breed is said to be the most dangerous, but there's no evidence to support this. People say that the dog's temperament has a lot to do with the dog's owner. Unfortunately, people have exploited this breed of dog in awful ways. Marisa and Chris knew that these dogs were loyal and caring if in a proper environment, and that they're not inherently dangerous. Little did they know that they were about to meet one very special pup. Looking around the shelter, Marisa knew she was faced with a tough choice. She'd made a promise to Chris and said that she would only choose one dog to take home. But there were so many friendly faces. Then she spied one dog in the corner and her mind was made up. She knew what she had to do. One dog swayed as she walked over to greet Marisa, and she quickly realized that she was heavy with puppies. She was a stunning brindle pit bull, and one pleading look into Marisa's eyes, and it was all over. Marisa knew that this dog was the one. But as the staff told them her story, shivers went up and down Marisa's spine. The staff at Pibbles and More told them that Pitbull's name was Story, and her previous owners were backyard breeders who had surrendered her as they couldn't afford to look after her and her puppies. Marisa and Chris knew exactly what they had to do take her into their home and give her the attention she so deserved. Then they got some news from their local vet. Story had been due to give birth over a week ago. But the staff at the shelter were all confused as to why she hadn't had her puppies yet, and she looked like she was big enough to give birth any minute. The staff tried to conceal their concern, but Chris and Marisa saw it immediately. Story needed help, and fast. When she rested her head on Marisa's lap and looked up into her eyes, Marisa knew she was trying to tell her something. But she couldn't take in another dog as well as another six puppies, could she? Marisa had no idea that this was just the tip of the iceberg. Marisa knew that if she took Story and her puppies home, she would have 17 dogs in total to contend with. But her mind was made up. She had to help this poor dog. She couldn't leave her at the shelter. But she was worried. Why hadn't the dog given birth yet? What were they getting themselves into? Chris and Marisa were at a loss. Why was Story's labor so delayed? In all the time they'd been rescuing pit bulls, they'd never encountered a problem like this before. The worst-case scenarios were playing through their minds, and that's when they decided to do some research. But what they read only made them feel worse. Dogs are a lot smarter than we give them credit for. Chris and Marisa had stumbled upon an article that started to put the whole situation into perspective. Story had obviously endured trauma and stress, and especially so during her pregnancy at the shelter. A dog's life at a shelter is uncertain, and the upheaval often causes even more anxiety. Marisa and Chris researched the matter all that they could and started to realize just how dire the situation was. Story could lose her puppies if she didn't give birth soon. Then Marisa shrieked as it finally clicked. A stressed dog will not give birth in a stressful environment. 
Marisa looked at Chris and they jumped into the car. Story needed a vet and fast. But when the vet saw the images on the ultrasound, she couldn't believe her eyes. She thought it must be a mistake. But there it was, in black and white. The vet turned to the couple with a look that made their hearts drop. Then she delivered some earth-shattering news. The vet still couldn't believe what she was seeing. She counted and counted in disbelief. Then she told Marisa and Chris something that made them gasp for air. There aren't six puppies, but twelve. Chris and Marisa exchanged worried looks, and Marisa started shooting questions at the vet. How could this be? But more importantly, would Story be okay? The vet didn't know what to say. There were twelve puppies inside Story, and she should have given birth already. But checking the ultrasound, she said that they appeared to be thriving. So she sent the worried couple home with Story with instructions to call her without delay if she still hadn't given birth within 48 hours. But what they all didn't know was that Story had been holding out for a reason. When the shell-shocked couple left the vet, they didn't feel any better about the situation. Story could lose her puppies and this could be dangerous for her too. Marisa was worried that she wouldn't give birth within 48 hours. After all, she'd held out for this long already. Marisa's heart went out to Story. Then she had an idea. Marisa decided that she would do all she could to make Story comfortable. Chris had the brilliant idea of giving the poor dog her own space to minimize her stress. So they cleared an entire room in their home and filled it with soft pillows and blankets. Story needed to feel secure and safe. Then as soon as they went to bed, a miracle happened. After Marisa and Chris made sure that Story would be comfortable, they went to bed themselves. It had been a long and stressful day. Then during the night, something amazing happened. When the couple awoke, they found Story nursing her 12 puppies, and they were all big and healthy. They were elated that she'd finally given birth, and they knew exactly why Story had waited. Dogs having puppies at shelters, it's not the best thing for them. It's stressful for her, stressful for the puppies, Chris said later. Story had refused to bring her puppies into a potentially unsafe shelter and had waited until she knew she was in safe hands. It was almost as if she had a feeling that the stars would align and that Marisa and Chris would bring her home. Story had given birth after being in a new, loving environment for just 24 hours, and Chris and Marisa were so relieved that she finally had. All Story had needed was to feel safe and loved. Thanks to the compassion of the animal-loving couple, all 12 puppies were alive and healthy. It was truly a miracle. The puppies opened their little eyes just two weeks later. And Chris and Marisa felt more in love with the little furballs every day. In no time, the little pups were playing in the garden on their shaky little legs. And Story seemed to be a contented and devoted mother. Shortly after, adoption requests began to pour in. Marisa and Chris had used their good judgment and decided not to keep any of the puppies, even though they were very attached to them. They wanted to make room in their home for more rescues who needed their help. All the puppies found loving forever homes quickly and at 10 weeks old, they were all collected by their new families. But what about Story? Story has her happy ending, too. Shortly after her story was posted on Facebook, an experienced pit bull owner couldn't wait to meet her. As soon as he did, he fell in love with her and took her home. Story's been sterilized and has a long and happy life ahead of her. And she'll never have to go through such a stressful ordeal again. Story had been an exceptional mother to all 12 of her puppies, and Chris and Marisa were inspired to help more dogs like her. Finally, Story could breathe easy, knowing that the stressful time of her life was finally over, and she'd be given the care and love she so deserved. All 12 of Story's pups had found loving homes, and all thanks to one dedicated couple. They continue to raise awareness about dogs in need and highly advocate adopting dogs from shelters. If it weren't for them, Story's fate could have been a lot worse. Story's story is unfortunately just one of many. She's very lucky to have found such an incredible home with an owner who will always care for her. Shelters have their hands full with abandoned and surrendered dogs on a daily basis, and there are hundreds of amazing dogs and cats out there looking for homes. If you can't adopt a pet, then perhaps you can foster. If you can't foster, then you can donate. If you can't donate, then you can still spread awareness about all the loving animals looking for homes.